Hello everyone and welcome back to another lesson of the Arabic language. This is lesson number... Uh, not quite. Um, sorry, this is not an Arabic lesson. This is a message to my viewers. So, uh, basically, I want to say that I'm back. Uh, the session, the semester was... Uh, I just finished the semester uh, not too long ago. So, basically, now I have more free time still have work to do but uh, I have more free time so yay I can make more videos so basically I'm going to continue with the videos that I have the last video that I did was Arabic language lesson number 15 and it was two months ago so yeah that that's a really long period uh, so I'm sorry for that so today I'm going to discuss with you what I'm going to teach uh, in the co uh, upcoming ca lessons. Also I'm going to answer some frequent questions and I'm going to show you some cool websites. I hope I have, uh, I can do all these under 10 minutes. So basically, let's, let's start. Um, basically the Arabic language lessons. I'm going to continue uh, with 16 and above in the same fashion, um, teaching you how to write. There's not much left uh, in these lessons, maybe a couple or, I don't know, up to four more lessons uh, in writing, but I will continue with some basic grammar uh, and it will be in the same lesson series. So it will be Arabic language lesson number and so on. The new thing is Arabic pronunciation. So I'm working on these. Um, what, what, what I'm planning is that I will have a bunch of letters that sound the same. So I will group similar um, similar letters together and I'll start to pronounce them over and over and over and over until you get it or die. Uh, <laughs> yeah well, uh, not quite, it's just it, there's a lot of repetition involved so, so you get the idea. Um, so you might get bored so basically if you really not interested in pronunciation I can recommend I can recommend um, not viewing these lessons so this is especially for people who cannot distinguish between letters and they say like oh I cannot hear that sound how do you pronounce that how do you pronounce this I know that there is a lot of Arabic um, letters that are um, a bit hard so all I can say is practice makes perfect and um, yeah work hard um, for Arabic phrases well these lessons are like I'm still thinking about them so I don't know if I'm going to do them or not so basically what I'm thinking is that I'll have some Arabic phrases and like basically just to, s to tell you like how to say hi, how to say goodbye, how to say thank you, how to reply on these, I'll say them in different di di dialects and in the standard modern Arabic or the modern standard Arabic, I kind of forgot which one's the correct one. Anyways, so you get the idea. But the only problem that is stopping me from actually starting these lessons is that there is a lot of videos out there on YouTube that deal with that. So basically, do I really need to repeat stuff? I hate, you know, repeating um, what other people did. So I'm looking for some original ideas. And if you really have some, please contact me. So if you have any idea, just let me know. Arabic reading sessions. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to look up some stories, basically uh, kids stories when uh, online there's a lot and I'm going to read them for you. I'm going to look for very simple one, basic ones that are easy to understand, you get the main vocabulary that you need and uh, I think you get the idea, there's nothing really special about that but uh, I don't, I didn't find anyone who does that on YouTube I guess it's something new so basically that's another idea so I need your feedback on all these if you have any good ideas please let me know uh, the next thing so answering frequent questions okay so uh, 
some of the questions that I get uh, are like do I know any good books any good teachers uh, any good websites to learn Arabic from and basically unfortunately I don't um, I'm not a teacher so basically I don't really know what's out there and what to have I'm just a normal guy who teaches Arabic on YouTube and all I can recommend is an other youtubers out there who teach Arabic and I think they have real good stuff um, out there um, so if you're interested let me know the other thing that people keep ask, uh, asking me where are you from and uh, uh, well all I can say I'm sorry it's a seek oops secret anyways I'm not in the mood to <laughs> right so it's a secret um, um, yeah so please stop asking that another thing is um, what programs that I use um, this question I, s I, I got it like since since ever since I started this uh, these lessons and the answer is very quickly I, I use screen recorder and Photoshop screen recorder is the programming they see here it's very simple doesn't need a lot of skill to operate it it's, um, it's a freeware I got it online I cannot find honestly uh, a link that is working anymore for this so what I did is that I uploaded this for you guys and I'll post the link uh, for the installation file in the description so it's on the right Photoshop. The next thing that I use, the one that you see I'm writing here, that's Photoshop. What I use is basically a tablet, which is just uh, kind of a board with a pen that interface that has an interface to uh, um, to a PC. And basically, uh, that's a tablet. If you don't know what's a tablet, just Google it. And I use that to write on Photoshop and um, well, what do I want to say okay so um, how yeah the next question is how do I, do I do I use them well basically I start my screen recorder I start recording and I what I do is I just open a new file in Photoshop and change my pen uh, brushes my pens actually do I use a brush yeah I use a pro, uh, the brush tool here and I change basically I right click on the screen to get this um, window and then I press the arrow here and choose calligraphic brushes so I have to say ok choose a brush choose a size and wait I'm gonna write shukran which means thank you guys so uh, basically so uh, one thing to I want to say also is thank you for all the people who uh, commented um, I got really really kind comments from you guys and thank you for people who took the time to actually like give me a feedback on what I'm doing so uh, I don't have so much time left uh, in one minute I'm going to show you two websites that that's worth um, trying out one thing is the Arabic keyboard it's uh, I'll, I'll post a link in the description so you have a keyboard and you can write Arabic even though you don't have Arabic on your computer there is also the alamat uh, al-tashkil, the accents so you can add as much as you want and you play with these the other website is translate.google.com and basically uh, you can translate whatever you want from any language to any language oops, okay, I hope it's still working okay, um, and the cool thing is translated search so here you can actually choose my language is uh, English the language that is one search in is Arabic and write like for example an Apple and here's what I get I get the translation which is Apple I get on the right side um, websites that are in Arabic and the left is the translation of these websites so it's fantastic I'm running out of time that's all for today uh, thank you very much for watching my videos.